Hello everyone, I'm Actus here, and welcome to part tw no, 20, why was I going to say 20, part 10 of Paper Mario and Thousand Year Old Door. Last episode, we defeated Hotel and got the first Crystal Star and ended chapter 1. In this episode, we're going to see what all these Mario faces mean. Hmm. Well, there's Peach getting kidnapped again, but what's usual, or what's new? Same old, same old, basically. And there's that guy who was asking about the Crystal Stars. Maybe they have something in common. Oh, great, excellent, Grotus. We have brought the Princess Peach you had ordered. Whoa, that was weird. Well, 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 my pet. Isn't it about time you told us where the map is? Dude. Dude. I, I'm pretty sure as I said before, but he pretty much looks like a blooper. With a helmet and glasses on and a cape around it. The blooper's trying to take over the world, man. Princess Peach, you will speak when spoken to. Dude, you're so old-fashioned, yet you have a giant computer chip in your head. Like, no one does speak when spoken to anymore. Like, seriously. I'm telling you, I don't know. There's no point in trying to hide it, you silly girl. We knew you had it. We knew this. Trust me, it's very much in your interest to uh, absurdly honest with us. We X-nuts are not all rainbows and lollipops, I assure you. We're quite nasty. A uh, giant hologram. Grota, sir, I have news, sir. Report at once. You know the crystal star? We thought maybe Hooktail had it. Well, someone nabbed it. What? What did you say? Someone else is after the crystal stars. And he defeated Hooktail. Wow, sexy. It's just assume it's a guy, you fuck. You say, speak, soldier. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. There is more to it, see. According to this report, it was a mustache dude in a red hat and blue overalls who pulled the job. Mario! Peach, you dumbass. Excuse me, Mario? Oh no! Gah, 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 gah. I see, so you know this Mario, do you? Hmm. This fool matters not at all. All I know is about him before long, I promise. I grow bored of talking. Take Princess back to her hold room. Yes, sir. And men. Take good care for Princess Peach, understood? She is not to be harmed. But if she wants a little, um, you know, just give it to her, because she's a girl and she needs those kinds of stuff every once in a while. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> well, Lord Crump, if this Mario character has a map, then that's highly likely you'll find the Crystal Star we're hunting in the Boggly Woods. You must return there immediately and has has thing they has, uh, back. Situation. It must not fail. What's up? Oh yeah, Sir Roger Grotus. And uh, what's up, Phew, I'm gone. I wonder if sending Lord Crump there alone is wise. He's a bit of a out there. Hmm. Excellent. I summon you. Wow, he doesn't even trust his own minions. Seriously, dude. You rag, dude. I mean, sir. I mean, sir Grotus, dude. Grotus, sir. Grotus, sir. Shut up. Go get the Shadow Sirens over here. The sh Shadow Sirens are here, but the, they... I don't care how you plan to end that sentence, fool. Get them now! Gotcha. Hmm. I wonder what they're about. That horrible Grotus has need of us? Then we arrive without delay. The Shadow Sirens, the three Shadow Sisters or whatever. Mwee hee hee hee! Pray tell me, did the princess tell you where the map is? Split your tongue, Beldum. Isn't that a Pokemon? More Pokemon references! Uh -huh. We were all, would already have it if you snatched her earlier. But now, since you missed your chance, some poor fool named Mario has the map. It wasn't my fault, Trey. There's so many people, many praying eyes. There are too many. Besides, a strange old man showed up at the moment of truth, and we had to retreat. Why worry? We already need to... We already need to do now is find this Mario and steal the map. Yes? Indeed, this is your duty, must I remind you. The map is vital to the x nauts plan. I will have my men prepare prepare all available information on this Mario. For now, hear me, Beldum. The Shadow Sirens must take care of the Troublemaker. Mwee <laughs> Fear not, sir. I, Beldum, shall return with what you seek. Let's go, my lovelies. Merlin. Mar Marlin? I think that's Marlin. Vivian! Come on, we got a job to do. Go ahead. 
Mm-hmm. Okay. So we're looking through a random scrim water. Oh, it's pretty stars. So, okay, it's some random ass room. And here we are in Peach's room. We get to watch Peach. Oh dear, here we go again. I can't believe I'm kidnapped again. Mario and Toadless must be worried sick again. No, so, uh, this, actually, the intro, the prologue is the last time you ever actually have to talk to Toadsworth ever again. But hang on, where in the world am I? So unfamiliar. I wish I could at least know that Toadsworth has no, been caught and all that shit. So let's just... Oh, oh, it's unlocked. Woo! Let's unlock. Let's go in here. Oh my god. We can watch Peach take a crap. What a lovely shower. Not any... No, soap's come even. Wow, I wonder if it works. Let's see, Peach. Show me if it works. Oh, god damn it. Shower curtains always ruin the fun. We can't see paper Peach naked. Of course, this game is rated E, so I highly doubt we'd ever see any nudity in this. But man, I wouldn't mind seeing some ass here. Ah, uh, hee hee. Mm-hmm. Wait. Oh, never mind. And then, of course, she doesn't get out of the bathtub to dry herself. Like, dude, you're, you're standing in water, and you put your dress on in the bathtub. That's so weird. And she gets out, and she has makeup on and did her hair. What? Like, that. But she just had a shower, and she... How did she have time to put on makeup and do her hair? But, like, it makes no sense. Hmm, how is that? The doors open by themselves. That is quite weird if you think about it. But if you don't think about it, it's not weird at all. Weird, it doesn't look like anyone's around. Just keep walking, Peach. Keep, keep walking. How do I keep making these doors open? How odd. Maybe it's not you, Peach, that's making the doors open. Maybe something else. Like a computer that controls the place. Like, you know, this computer right here. Oh my god, we have lights. Oh my god, look at all that. It's... Keyboard is weird. Holy crap. Why is that keyboard so weird? Hello, Princess Peach. Huh? What? Who, who, who said that? Where are you? How amusing. I'm right here before your eyes. I'm the laboratory's main computer. I'm Tech XX. You may call me Tech. You may. Sir Gordas created me to be a perfect computer. One that's flawless in its reason. Grotus, wait, he's that awful dumbheaded thing who interrogated me, right? Sir Grotus is not awful, he is very he's a very great person. He is a marvelous. Well, I don't think so. But I doubt I'll change your mind, so I'm wondering, why did you lead me here? I I'm unsure. An unsure program div deviation occurred when I was observing you earlier. Wow, stock. She, he basically watched her have a shower. That's. It always happens, man. It always happens when you watch them have a shower. To speed through my processes. These events are now new to me. There are more to this phenomenon as well. I ran diagnostic program, and their solution was I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. That is creepy as fuck. It's such a. Who's you not scared that the. Compulsion has no precedence, cause of unknown. I, the perfect computer, I must diagnose this unusual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. Wait, did you just say you want to observe me and to know more about me? Peach, I would bitch slap the fuck out of that computer. Could it be that you? No, impossible. It can't be. You're, you're a computer. What happened to me? If you know my mal malfunction, you must tell me of it. Oh, I couldn't really because uh, it's just too weird. Please tell me, please. I am the world's best computer. I am perfect. Just like how it gets this was perfect. There should not be anything that I cannot understand. Please. Well, do you know, maybe is it possibly that while well, you're in love with me? What love? What is what is love? Baby, don't hurt me. No, I'm kidding. I cannot compute this. Wait, you don't know what love is? Dude, just look it up on Google. Just Google it. Like, seriously. Love. How do I explain it? Love tells you when you want to be with the person forever. It makes you feel happy just to see that person happy. Smiling. Having fun. When you love someone, you, you will do anything to help them. He or she in trouble. Happiness. Fun. I have definitions for these words, but... My programming is... Instigate. There sh should not be... I cannot com ha comprehend. I am a perfect computer. 
Comprehend love? Love is not something you comprehend, Tech. It's you feel it. Princess Peach, I will, will you teach me the? F you will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? What? You're you're, you're a computer. Why would I care about love? Why would you care about love? I am perfect. There must there must be nothing I cannot comprehend. Nothing. That is why you must help me understand this thing called love. Please, if you have any wishes that I can grant to you in exchange, I will grant them. But of course, I am unable to grant such a wish as letting you escape. What are you insane? The ex-jerks kidnapped me like, like common Koopas. And now you're calling me here to ask me to teach you about the meaning of love? I should spit on your screen you grant my wish? How? Why should I believe you? I understand you are angry. That emotion I comprehend. You need not to teach me now. But I must learn this thing. There is nothing alternative. I must be a perfect computer. That is why I would just consider teaching me. I will grant any wish. Do you understand, Princess Peach? Now, tell me your wish. Are, are you sure? O okay, here it goes. Can I contact someone? The sooner the better. Yes, of course you may. Use my com communicator to send wireless mail, I mean email, to anywhere you want. I if you wish so, you can use it right here now. It's no trouble at all. Use the keyboard in front of me. Enter the recipient's address and message. You mean like this keyboard? No, the keyboard on his dick. Alright, let me give it a shot. So, Peach is just like, oh shit, I forgot Mario's email. Oh crap. Okay, Tech, can you send it? Nope. Nope, that's the one thing I can't do. Can't send it. Can't? No. Impossible to send. Sorry. Can't send. Message has been sent. Shit, Tech, you just made me a liar. For the time being, you may return to your room. Well, I will call you again when I want to ask you about something. Uh, okay then, good night. Good night, Princess Peach. So, Peach isn't really happy about her kidnappers, though who would be happy that they got kidnapped? Uh, what time are we at? Mm -hmm. Eh. I'm just thinking about it. Now, I'll continue going. We're only 15 minutes in, and there's a bit of talking, but there's really not much talking left. Or 15 minutes, or 12. Down. Well, almost 13, actually. And now we're looking at a different person. Well, Turtle from Peach. Peach isn't the turtle, by the way. We're looking at a different creature altogether from Peach. The one who usually kidnapped her, the one known as the common Koopa, perhaps. It's King Bowser. Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
The crystal stars you say they sound like a good world conquering tool as I want them. Hmm, yes, very good. Continue researching this for me, your bra brain your uh your brainy hag you. Yes, sir, thank you, sir. Leave it to me. By the way, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? You bet I do. Do I? I love fried eggs, I love them, but what a weird question. Why do you ask? Well, during Mario's recall, and I slipped on a lovely place called Petal Meadows. I was planning to take everyone there on a picnic and have some eggs and toast. Of course, I wouldn't think about saying invites without asking you first, Lord Bowser. A picnic? You moron! This is no time for fun. See, this is why my evil plans always fail. Uh, uh, always derail because you clowns always goof off. Oh, oh dear, Lord Bowser, please cut them. Remember your high blood pressure? Huh? What's that? Mumble mumble. What? Is this true? Lord Bowser, terrible news. Some blood old full of abducted, abducted Princess Peach in airport. Huh? What? Tell me you're lying, Cammy. How? When? Where? Who? Who does such a thing? Besides me? I'm afraid we don't have any information quite yet. The investigation's ongoing. One more thing is certain. Confirmed, however, that Princess Peach has been kidnapped. Under no circumstances is anyone allowed to kidnap her without my say so. I will not stand for this. I'm going to report now. I gotta kidnap her back. So. Bowser is going to save Princess Peach, but he's going to kidnap her. So basically, you don't have to do any work. Just let Bowser do all the work and then kick him because he's pretty easy to kill. And then she's just like, wait, but but your greatness, wait, wait up. And they fly off in the sunset together. There's Bowser's castle. It changes every freaking time in every freaking game. But I think it's hard for taste parts the next time a paper month has your old door. We will continue as Mario and go forth into the next chapter and see where the next crystal star lies. See you guys then, bye!